So the Mark II kits are our antidote kits if we get exposed, and these are only to be used on us. These are not for our patients. This is if we happen to get contaminated in a hazmat scene or a terrorist act and, and we get exposed to it and we need to save ourselves. Um, so these are sort of a stopgap measure for us that will hopefully get us through and get us to where we can get more help. Every ambulance is supposed to have one of these type kits or something similar to it that has similar medications. When do we use these? Well, actually it tells us on the back. And if you remember your sludges from your hazmat or toxicology chapters, um, you know that if you are exposed and you're experiencing these signs and symptoms of salivation, crying, having to go to the bathroom, both urination, defecation, you're sick to your stomach, cramping, uh, vomiting, that's emesis, um, or if you have any uh, twitching and muscle spasms, we're supposed to use these, these kits. Now, when we open them up, there's actually two kits in here. And if you have just one package, this is one for you and one for your partner. If you have two packages, then you may have one and a backup if you need it. Um, like the first kit doesn't work well enough for you. Now to use these, it's very simple. They have a one and they have a two. That makes it easy. So you take the cover off and inside are the two auto injectors. And the caps are actually embedded in here. So when you pull out number one, it's active and ready to go. The green part is going to go against your thigh and just like an EpiPen, you press that in until it ejects. And then when you're done with that, you record the time and dispose of it. And then on number two, same thing, auto injector, hold it, push it against your thigh, it injects and um, hold it there for a couple of seconds until the medicine ejects and then you can record the time and dispose of it and you have now administered your, your antidote. This will not work against everything that we're exposed to, but many of the uh, chemicals, toxins that we have in like a, a hazmat scene or a terrorist act, these will help with. But these are only to be used for you and only to be used if you get exposed.